CEO of Play Lady Productions, and I'm also the drama leader for Sozo Performing Arts Ministry. And this is my assistant, Phyllis. And what we do basically is we go around to different um, organizations and different nonprofits and churches, and we do gospel stage plays. Uh, my first stage play was back in 2007 called Lunch Date. It, it was about um, a lot of social issues, domestic violence, um, drugs, um, things of that nature. And what we're about to do now is launch uh, Preach the Word. I, I, uh, we're about to launch Preach the Word, it's a gospel stage play. Preach the Word is the stage play in 2009 where I won um, a national award for it. And we will be launching that in Easton, May 4th, for the Neighborhood Center. And Preach the Word is what we call a gospel thriller. Um, the audience will never be able to sit still because something is always going on. And what happens in Preach the Word, it's about a couple, a pastor and their wife, and they move to um, her hometown and they start a church. But they don't count on running into a lot of the problems that they run on. Um, what happens is that many of the people are working against their marriage, a lot of gossip is going on, and different things are going on, and the pastor was not prepared to deal with certain problems or certain issues that arise in the church. So it's a, definitely a gospel thriller just when you think it's going to be quiet or just when you think it's going to be over, something is going to happen to catch your attention. Writing for me is something that I've always done. I've been doing it since the fourth grade, but I kind of put it up because I didn't think that I could really make a career of it or that my writings would make a difference. But um, being in Greater New Hope Church and Ministries um, under Bishop Coleman and First Lady Levita Coleman, I had an opportunity, um, I, I was directing dance, and I had an opportunity where they needed a different idea. So I went home one night and was able to write up a, a, a play called Lunch Date, which I premiered in 2007, and to my surprise, the audience loved it, and I was even asked to uh, perform it in Easton. And so since that time, I've been writing and going to different plays and reading and learning, and you know, it eventually led to Preach the Word, um, Janitor Man, and some of the other plays that I've directed and written. Okay, our next project for Sozo Performing Arts Ministry um, will be The African Princess. It's a musical, and we are looking for children of all ages, of every community, every ethnicity, race, it doesn't matter. Um, we really want to do this as a community project, and we are going to start auditioning in June, probably near the end of June. And we're going to, you know, put flyers out and different things so everyone will know um, exactly where to come and where we'll have our auditions um, set up. Um, and what we plan to do is really, really make this a community effort. And we're going to premiere it on Watch Night, December 31st at 7 o'clock. Um, we don't have a venue yet, but as soon as we do, I will let you know. upcoming events, you can look me up on Facebook under Trina Bledsoe Ringgold. We post all the time.